In this demonstration, I will use Vista TF to analyze the geometry of a centrifugal compressor in the early stages of its design process. At this point, I have finished refining the compressor's three-dimensional geometry using Blade Editor. An explanation of this process can be found in a separate video that overviews the capabilities of Blade Modeler. Now I want to determine if my current design conforms to a certain set of essential criteria. Most importantly, I would like to determine the work coefficient and the Dehaller ratio for this compressor geometry. Although CFX is more than capable of doing this type of analysis, I can make my design optimization process more efficient by using Vista TF, a program developed by ANSYS partner, PCA Engineers. ANSYS Vista TF is integrated into the ANSYS Workbench platform and acts as a two-dimensional through-flow solver. It fills the space between one-dimensional correlations and three-dimensional CFD, providing rapid initial analysis of rotating machinery before proceeding to more rigorous and detailed three-dimensional fluid flow simulations. After transferring the geometry and selecting Setup in Vista TF, I can specify the solver settings, operating conditions, working fluid properties, and the initial conditions. With the solver settings and starting conditions specified, the problem is automatically transferred to the solver. In seconds, a solution is found and transferred to CFD posts for analysis. Regarding the solver, Vista TF is a streamlined curvature through flow program for the analysis of all turbo machinery types, but with special emphasis on single stage centrifugal machines such as radial pumps, turbines, and compressors. The through flow solver uses two dimensional streamlined curvature methods where losses are derived from correlations or user specified polytropic efficiency. Additional empirical methods are used to provide data for the loss production for the boundary layer blockage and for the deviation of the flow direction from the mean blade camber surface, so that the effect of viscosity can be taken into account. Upon opening CFD Post, we will notice that CFD Post has produced a table summarizing the quantitative data and performance results for this geometry. As I scroll down through the report, we can see some relevant contour maps showing the pressure, temperature, and solution error along the meridional plane. As well, blade loading charts displaying the Dehaller ratio, incidence, and variation have been generated by CFD Post. At this point, I have evaluated my compressor's geometry using Vista TF and CFD Post. Now I want to optimize the geometry to produce a target work coefficient with an appropriate Dehaller ratio. To accomplish this, I will add an expression defining the Dehaller ratio and the work coefficient. Once defined, these expressions can be set as workbench output parameters. Prior to this demonstration, I designated a series of parameters in Blade Editor, which can be used in a variety of optimization processes. To this parameterization bar, I can add a response surface allowing me to perform a controlled optimization process. First, in the Design of Experiments section, I can set the input variables for this optimization. In this case, I will select the inducer hub radius ratio, the trailing edge blade width ratio, the trailing edge beta angle, and the trailing edge theta angle. The optimization can be constrained and controlled in the response surface optimization tab. Here, I will tell Workbench to find a geometry with a target work coefficient of 0.62 while maintaining a Dehaller ratio that exceeds 0.58. Upon updating the optimization tab, Workbench generates a thousand samples, reviews these, then selects three candidates which fit the specified criteria. Once the calculation is complete, I can see what values best fit the criteria under the Candidate Points option. 
Using the candidate points selected, I can confidently proceed with my optimization process and use the determined geometry in more rigorous calculations. This concludes this demonstration overviewing the capabilities of ANSYS VISTA TF in the context of early stage centrifugal compressor design optimization.